Hey everybody, this is Christy from Christy's Creative Corner. And I have been working on a journal with, of a DigiKid from Donna Bell. And it's not done, but it's in process. But I just wanted to show you the Digis and or the kit or whatever you call it and just show you some of the work that I've done in it um it's uh I've kind of got it partly together and partly not but I want to show you the cover oh my bad hang on this is the cover of it I just find the one who makes your heart smile so and that's that's going to be the cover and then um, when you open it up you have this one here move that down this is one of her pages and then I'm using some tea stained some coffee stained paper and on this I it's a tuck spot with an envelope that I really wanted to use and it's not all put together as you can see but I wanted to show you how far I've gotten with it I love this one this is one of her papers and I really love this and I love the little hearts that go up there and then some more tea stained paper and then I put some lace here with a piece of ribbon that says with love and then I just took this tattered up cardstock and put on here and then here is the another one of her papers and I love this color I'm enjoying this process um, So, this is a really beautiful paper. Just a second, I gotta get a drink of coffee here. And then there's gonna be some more tea stained paper. And then on this page, I just wanted to take some ledger paper and make a pocket. And then some glitter paper to make another pocket. And then this ribbon to make a belly band. And then I wanted to put this in there because I love that image for, oh, for a journaling card. And then I wanted to put this in there for a journaling card. So, and then you flip it over to another one of her beautiful papers. I love this paper. I love this image. And then it's going to be followed up by some more of my tea stain paper. And then with this, I wanted to use an envelope and a beautiful little image here of a cup of coffee. And this is a tuck spot for another one of them cards. I thought that would be a nice addition to her digis. So, and then you open it up, and then there's another one of her, her digis for this kid. And she did such a great job with the digis. They're very, very, very pretty papers. And then, again, you follow that. I'm going to follow that up with some tea stained paper. And then here, this is a pocket that has been sewn. And I left the loose threads on it because I love that. And then it says, follow your soul. And like I said, it's a pocket. Love it. I love how that looks with it. And that follows up another one of her, her images. And it says, seize the day. Love this absolutely love it I love the pink and then it'll be followed up by some more tea stained paper 
And then on this paper, I wanted to put just a simple image, which is very pretty. And then an envelope. Oh, sorry. An envelope that flips open to where you can put secrets in it. And then this opens up to another one of her beautiful, very pretty digis. And it says, love is patient, love is kind. And I love that. That is one of the scriptures in 1 Corinthians. Love is patient, love is kind, love does not boast. Love, you know, love it. And I love the birds. And then that's going to be followed up by another piece of tea stain paper. And then on this one, it's got just this card here, and you open it up, and you can journal on this side with this beautiful floral image. And then you open that up to another really pretty uh, one of her digis. Love it. I love the colors. And then it's followed up by another piece of my tea stain paper. Haven't done anything with this yet. But the center is this beautiful digi of hers. And it says, live peacefully, love tenderly, walk softly, speak kindly. I love that thing. So this is going to be the center of my journal. And I'm just going to fold it all up like this. And I'm going to sew it all together. And I'm going to add, you know, some more to it. And this is the back side of it. So you're going to get a little bit of all her digis and her images in this journal. So, and I, I love how it looks. I really think this is going to be awesome once I get it done. And then this is the back side of that envelope, that tuck spot. So that's going to be really cool. So, yeah, I mean, and I, as you can see, I haven't done a whole lot to it. It's a process, but I got a special order for Christmas that I have to get done. It is a must. So I've got to put this one on hold for right now. But I just wanted to share with you what I'm doing and what I'm working on. So, and I want to take my time with this and do the digis of hers justice. So, but yeah, this is the, the back side of the journal. So yeah, I think it's going to be great, at least I hope so once I'm done. And it's going to be a, a nice size. I don't really measure out my journals. Maybe I should, but I don't. But yeah, this is going to be an awesome journal, I think, once I get it done. So, and again, these images are from Donna Bell. Donna, these are absolutely beautiful did, uh, images. I don't know how to put your info in my thing. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not really technically inclined. But just want to give a shout out to you. I hope I do these images proud. And I will be making a video of my process. And I might even go live with it. And, um, work on it a little bit with the holidays coming up. You know, that's time for my family. So, yeah. But anyways, just wanted to, to give you a shout out, Donna. And just show everybody what I'm working on. And hopefully the, the finished project is going to be amazing. I hope. So anyways, I hope you like this video. Um, and, uh, I can't wait to finish this. You all have a great day. I'm going to leave you like I always do with the count your blessings and be a blessings. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.